Question five, what metrics should the sheriff's office use to track use of force and community policing demographics? And how should the data be shared with the community to ensure full transparency and accountability? Mr. Olson, you have 60 seconds. Well, I just recently received the 2019 Kitkas County Sheriff's uh, Annual Report, and in it, I noticed that there was nothing in there as far as use of force goes. Um, that is something that I would uh, want to do. I believe that we should uh, be sharing use of force incidences. And how, how I would break that down and what metrics I would use is, I think it would be important to uh, explain use of force incidents uh, on how much time a deputy has on, their sex, their race, their age, and then the suspect's information should also be shared, the suspect's age, race, sex, and then with that, with the suspects, uh, we should also be sharing their mental capacity, whether drug use was used, weapons involved, and the type of call. This information needs to be shared with our uh, uh, people, and it should be separated between deputies and correction officers, and something I would like to share in the future. Thank you. Uh, Mr. Myers, you have 60 seconds to respond. Thank you. The Sheriff's Office, um, have, we have a process in place. We have a policy in place. We have uh, forms in place and we're in line with the accreditation standards and WASPIC's recommended best policies and practices. Every use of force, uh, whether it's addressing uh, somebody who is injured that's innocent, a bystander or a suspect is reported. All of the data is reported up through the chain of command. It's reviewed. There's a number that's drawn. It goes onto a spreadsheet and it's investigated, every single one. If there's uh, at part of that investigation is to address, do we have a problem? Are we complying with policy? Do we have a training issue? Do we have an officer issue? Do we have a legal issue? That information is available to the public, um, just like all of the rest of the information with respect to public disclosure. So it's all available and Thank you. Uh, the end. <laughs> Thank you, I appreciate that.